So, there you have it. Don't be slipping. Don't be caught lacking. You understand that's what's happening at the man cave. You dig, your ass is in trouble. He's ready, he's coming to get you. You dig, you got a problem. It's my nephew, I didn't want to really have to do you like that, but do you like that, you understand? We ain't fucking around. We in this bitch, we ain't going nowhere. You understand that? God damn me. Big Sue. You dig? In your ass. He got me. And he ain't worried about a damn thing. You dig? It's going to fuck down. <laughs> I'm going to court trying not to see what you're going to do with him. Boy, I don't think you'll do nothing with my nephew. <laughs> Well, you want the problem if you want no smoke. <laughs> He's coming, you did. He ain't hiding at all. You, 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 you get what I'm talking about? <clears throat> you understand me? <clears throat> you understand where I'm coming from? <clears throat> you understand where you're coming from, son? He touched the rim, son. What that mean? If he could touch, the, he kissed the rim. That mean he can dunk. You dig on top out. I don't care what you said. No matter what you're going with, which way you want to ride with it, I'll ride my my nephew, my great nephew. That's my nephew's son, and he's my great nephew. And let me tell you something, son. Y'all ain't ready for it. He coming out the wheezy, gonna tear your ass up. Boy, yeah, that's what all I got to tell you. On the 17th of Christmas, Christ Mass is on, boy, pop like some good popcorn. You understand me? Yeah. Might as well, might as well get in your ass. Deep in your ass, you want all that ass, not just some, not just half. Boy, deep in your ass, you understand me? I don't know what nobody throws, but boy, boy, two thumbs, stay cock, lock, ready to rock, boy. Let me tell you something, nephew, coming out, out the burrow, you understand? Why? My nephew, bad boy, my great nephew, he bad boy. Let me tell you right now, y'all got troubles. He got his he got his coach, <laughs> Gramps Tony and shit. <laughs> That's his nutritionist. Plenty of confidant. The boy gonna make it, you understand? Ain't no way he can't. When you take the draws off that and just take it later, boy, on it. The draws. You 
think he ain't gonna oochie coot do no oochie coot boy he, he gonna get some draws you understand about a thing, boy. You understand? He was in good hands. You understand? Down here, he, he good. He get nice country. Yeah, you dig. Well, what's, what's good about it after all this COVID-19 bullshit? You dig what I'm talking about? Somebody just opened up a can of bullshit. Some of that surplus bullshit then started acting a goddamn fool. Oh, we got to kill the commies over here. And they ain't even have, that's what their great grandpa's talking about. Oh, open up some of this shit. Oh, let's start fighting and all this shit. That's the problem. You got too many people doing stupid shit. Not thinking about nobody else. But that there is an assumption because it's something more than just COVID. It's some bullshit in the air. And you need to stop killing the people and kill the COVID. That would help. Think, you know what I mean? Yeah. Look out. Because it, it don't stop. Sports is a game. You can't stop nobody from playing. You can't stop me. understand what I'm trying to tell you. The boy come around. He good. You feel me? You know. So, you got he, he, he Also, he played for the... What is that? When he go there. A drill team of destruction. He played the drums. Everybody trying to have, but I, I'm built this boy up real good. He ain't gonna need 
He don't be in a position. It's all about him. He be in control and all that. So you be looking out for him. That's one place. It's the proof is in the pudding. Proof is in the pudding. You dig what I'm talking about? Because what you don't want, listen, you put him on a whole, give him a whole new jersey, whole new team, and let him flow. Yeah, all that favoritism, you know. You want yours to shine, but you want to use them. You can't. Some people, they they, they they smart like that. Or you, you want to use them like that? Just sit back. I'm going to hardly do nothing because I'm going to get all these points up, and then all of a sudden you're going to sit me back over there. there you're going to try to put me in the last minute of the goddamn game. How the fuck you going to make up half the goddamn scores? That you down a hundred, you ain't you ain't got none. You want somebody to race up and down the damn court real quick and make a, and and do a hundred and one in two, two seconds. Shit, you go to hell, dumb motherfuckers. Nah, you ain't do my nephew like that. But I told him, nah, man, don't give up. You keep getting up, going to practice. You keep up, keep suited up. That's just our team. This is just where it gets started. Learn you. Just really when you, you learn is when you get on the court, perform. And that's what we're going to teach them, that it, no matter what, they're going to want you. The ones that be all the time on, you know, they make only half the points they shooting them bricks, half the bricks they shooting, you dig what I'm saying? Yeah, it's, it's, it, 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 you, you need to know that. You ain't hiding, got something for your ad, boy, you dig. Mm-hmm. It's going down. You did. Yeah, so y'all be looking now. Be looking out. He gonna be on the court soon. You dig? He gonna be on that first draft pick. Mm -hmm. Please believe me. making up something and then later on come back and see if we can't touch that up right
and make a monster out of the boy, y'all gonna be like, where'd he come from? Oh my God. See if we could do it without all the noise, right? can't be tired or lazy. Getting ready. <laughs> and the chicks and the girls gonna go wild for him. Oh, Trey, my oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. We ain't worried about you. Get over there with your pom poms and let daddy get let, let Dr. Trey get in and, 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 and sneakers and get on the court and do a little something for you. <laughs> And one, you dig, he gonna be there, you know what they call him, he's a technician, the wizard, I don't know, we'll find out what he wants to be called, what he, what he wants his handle to be. Ain't you all about football? How you gonna be about some basketball? Yeah, you know, don't get it twisted. You can you, you can double think it, do whatever you want to. Crazy, all that if you want to, but the boy is going down. <laughs> Another machine coming out here to you. Ready, look, you can just get over there, sit down, sit down, get out of the way, 
Boy, getting ready to perform. Listen. Let me tell you something. His daddy played football. His uncles played football. Here, let me show you right now. Right now. I'm going to show you right now. Right now. He's following in his uncle's footstep right now. See that? Huh? Read it. God damn it. Read it, boy. Read, nigga, read. What does that say? Read, nigga, read. <laughs> yeah. That part. Here, let me make sure you synced it. Because y'all niggas will be acting like we didn't see what you was talking you see it, nigga. <laughs> you see it, nigga. <laughs> you see it, nigga. What that say on there? That's his uncle right there. His uncle. His uncle right there. He following his footsteps of his uncle. You understand? He ain't fucking around. He getting in that ass, boy. Y'all don't want no boy like a razorback. Boy, you finna get them tusks for real, boy. Arr, you understand? Arr, you finna get it. You finna get it. <laughs> Rip your ass up to shreds. Oh, big sweet. I'll tear your ass up, boy. Or I'll be in your ass real deep. You understand what I'm talking about? Razor back, nation, boy. The boy didn't turn the boy into a razor back. He'll tear you up, boy. And your ass like draw, boy. <laughs> but them the Rams, so. <laughs> but he, uh, him a razor back. You understand? He said that little piece of funky ass corn. <laughs> he said, save that the trap for a rabbit, huh? <laughs> he said he needs to do do for real. He's that corn feeling shit. <laughs> you get done. <laughs> Eat a corn husk ass up. <laughs> Had that bitch jean. Have his his overalls bloody. <laughs> bloody. <laughs> With them tusks, you understand? Ha, ah, big sword. Tear your ass up, boy. <laughs> He says to his mother, hi, mom. <laughs> Today he with his uncle Piho, you understand? <laughs> he with his uncle Piho, he doing fine, baby. <laughs> Let you tell him, tell you himself. Y'all just 
Hold on. Hot sec. Yeti. We went outside. The connection try to try to funk up. Try to funk up on me right quick. But we got that footage. Later on, we'll drop that footage. Hold on. Talk to tell you, tell your mom, say hello, talk to her. What's up, Mom? Mm. My boss texted to pick up these gift cards and send them the PIN numbers. <laughs> you ready? Tell your mom, say, I'm doing good, ma. How you doing, ma? I'm doing good, ma. How you doing? All right. Say, he said, you heard him. He said, he's living his best life, and he ain't going back and forth with you huskers. Straight up. What time is, you did. He with his uncle Pie Hole. The boy going to be first draft pick. It don't matter what y'all talking about. My boy good. You heard me? He good. He getting the best lesson from Uncle Boy. He couldn't get it from a better athlete. Well, there's something. Show your face. Show your face. Dig you on top of that? Show your face. Drop up. You know. Russell Westbrook did. He come down here all the time. He stopped off to give bums something to eat. At the Salvation Army. Y'all think I'm lying, don't you? He be right over there and brought all kind of food. Dish you up some food. Be like, damn, how you doing, Russ? Man, woo, easy. He talk to you. He talk right to you. He ain't messed up at all. You heard me? Well, look at him. Russell Westbrook, come talk to him. Y'all you know, you know what I'm talking about? LeBron James going down through here. You understand what I'm talking about? Wow. <laughs> the ball good. I'm telling you right now. You're good. With his Uncle Pio. <laughs> Uncle Mo Love. <laughs> Uncle Buzz Buggy. You dig what I'm talking about? In that ad like draw, boy. He ain't worried about nothing. He got plenty of peers. Male and female, you go wild down here.
his chance to perform and shine no matter what y'all talking about you understand because i know all you got to do is trigger in a young person and boy you can't they're gonna be a, a athlete a junkie for it the rest of their life i was when i got triggered into sports long i just like it you dig what i'm saying i was i wasn't that kid just man and, and i started out a fat boy i wouldn't let the fat stop me that just mean i was <clears throat> healthy you know what i mean and you know yeah bro you know no i wasn't about to let the fat control me i controlled the fat when all the fat burnt off i had traps i had nick i had forearms i had hands i had biceps man look here the 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 the, the, the little the, the the mind just 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 <clears throat> regurgitated me out <laughs> and that was a whole man girls just <laughs> the girls <laughs> the females look man you know they try to hide you know they try they, they, i guess you would say they try to get shy but you can't deny it you know when when you your body's telling you your body's telling you you did your body telling you what you want you know. transformation for a boy to a man from boys to man let me tell you something gonna come around because they're gonna be where the boys that trust me trust me <clears throat> they're gonna listen all you got to do is perform go that way get on get tighten up your sneakers get on that basketball court tighten up your chin snap get your helmet right and, and, and your uniform your shoulder pads where they ain't too loose you did mm -hmm. get on that football field you know, that's, she can't find you, she find you at work, not over there mucking around. They find you, coach over there, dogging you out. That's where you want to be, getting dogged out on that basketball court or dogged out on that football field. It'd be so worth it when you get done. So you got to beat the next fella, you know for a position first of all you got to be able to take direction if he asking you to do something impossible you got to be that stupid to be trying to do it now what i'm talking about is something that's related to sports now we ain't talking about no dumb shit if you know the game you know what you want to play then there you go if it's calisthenics or something like that there you go get to it it's only gonna make you strong trust me because yeah i ain't doing and then she, yeah, motherfucker, crazy man. La, 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 la. And then you look around and you be trying to go. It, all the athletes, they they got dogged out. They got conditioned. You know what I'm saying? Till they smoking the coach. 
You know what I'm saying? You're smoking the coach. He ain't smoking you no more. That's the whole thing. Then you get a jersey. Pop. Then, then he starts sitting you on these rules what he wants to do these plays, right? Because on that other side, you don't know how conditioned they are. And boy, let me tell you something. They get to run around you out of breath. <laughs> he can't do nothing but pull you off the court or off the field and throw somebody else in there that's going to do better than you. Come on now. The whole thing is about to win the game right now. If you want, if, if you want it, if you want it, you got to reach for it. You got to go ahead and get it. You know, in his book, don't be scared of it. You got to try to fit that in your schedule for sure. Get them school books as much as you can. And pay attention to how to, no matter when, no matter what, you can answer the question. And get them on out your face. It's, it's look in the back of the glossary in the back and you'll find the answer for sure. Not you. You give them. And if you, this is a, when you go to the back and ask your question, you go, go back and there it is right there. It's a reference. Because you learned it. You see what I'm talking about? Now, you move on forward. Trust me, man. show I guess that's what I'm really trying to say you don't want to be a no show you want to be there especially that's what you want to do you did so you know, get in there get in there get in there so yeah we got our nephew trust me trust me
not that anybody was asking, but I'm letting you know what. You make no Olympians up in here, boy. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Sound better, but <clears throat> by ear. Oh, I got the C music. I'll be back to play it in your in your ear. <laughs> but I just want I just want to play it by ear right now. So it's a you don't like my you don't like my music. So then you hit the B. C sharp. And then go to E.
G platform, E sharp. And then you keep on going up. And so you hit that here. Go from D to C sharp. To E. Then to F sharp. a lot of moving around so that's you ain't got no choice but to hit an A I'll play it more straight next time. Anyway, we just had to get it in. Had to let y'all know, you know. Yeah. We got a first round draft pick. You did. <laughs> And one for your dog, Dirty Raggedy Ass. Wow. My nephew come, he gonna come see you, boy. He won't want with me. Who want with me, huh? No. <laughs> no, son. <laughs> yeah. Let you come on the basketball court. You ain't got time for that. Come on, look at him. You just get to the court. You got your shoes. You got your uh, uh, Gatorade. You got your mouthpiece. <laughs> and if you need glasses, you're going to be on that court getting down. Yes. It's so true. You ain't even let the boy miss out on his bread. You heard me? Yeah.
Somebody, the boy gonna be somebody. You understand me? He can't stop that boy. He can't stop that boy. <laughs> he can't stop that boy. Just build. You got nephew. You got a nephew. You got damn it. Build you one then. Blooded as fuck. Well, I'm telling you right now, <laughs> having cold blood like Michael Jordan, you dig? Your illness, you dig? Boy, <laughs> boy, boy, boy. Don't have them, boy. So many players on the team, man. Some of them don't even have rings, uh, championship rings, and they cold blooded. You understand what I'm talking about? Yeah. You got a problem, it's going down, boy. <laughs> Some kind of way out of here. Said a joke to the
Just can't handle the truth. <laughs> you can't handle the truth. That's your problem. So if you'll excuse me, I'll get back to my music. <laughs> and I'll be back with some more funk to smear in your ear. How about that? <laughs> more love. Out. <laughs> 